you're changing lives, you know, by the months, by the weeks, you know, every year, you know, more people are going to be coming. And I can't wait for them to know that, like, I can still eat sweets. Yeah. And be healthy. Doing all that, I was like, oh, I finally did it. And I know personally, the people who have the hardest time financially, whether it's like trying to make the payments or trying to pay for this, they also tend to be the people who see the absolute best results. And that's simply because that value means so much more to them. Yep. And it's going to mean so much more to them when they see those results. And they know that what they're getting and what they're paying for is going to completely transform their lives. So uh, I think you are literally a prime example of that. And that's exactly why you were able to excel. Let's crack a lacking, big dog. Been a minute. First and foremost, what was your biggest takeaway of joining TNT? And, you know, what exactly was like your favorite part about working with us? Biggest takeaway was realizing um, no matter how much effort you're putting in the gym, if you're not really tracking down like your protein intake and how much you're eating, yeah, everything that you're doing at the gym is just pretty much going to go to waste. When I was going on my own, I was like, you know, working out, doing the typical three sets, 10 reps, you know, wanting to get big, but mm -hmm. I would always plateau and I would like eat like whatever I wanted or, you know, however much I, I thought I needed. And I never really wasn't getting the results. But after training with you, I noticed that I was getting stronger, you know, by the month. And I was like, holy shit, like I've never felt this strong in my life. So that, that was the biggest takeaway for me. Dude, absolutely. And, uh, you know, speaking of that strength, man, what were some of the strength uh, PRs we had? I know we hit some freaking insane PRs working together. Yes. So I was never able to bench 225. Um, and then close to the end, I was able to do it. The most I was able to bench with you uh, under your program was 230. And, yeah, yeah. And we're 230. And then where'd you start at? Uh, a plate. And I was able to rep that like 10 times. Uh, so I know bench was a big one. Let's hear about that deadlift, man. That was the most exciting one yeah, for yeah. sure. Yeah. So, so deadlift, I wanted to do 315. Um, when I was able to do it once, I was like, this isn't enough. I want to do this, you know, six times. Like, I actually want to own this strength and be like, hey, no, like, I worked this hard and I did it. Um, so deadlifting uh, 315 six times was my biggest accomplishment. And then my Ooh. third, yeah, yeah, definitely. Let's go, And then the, the, my last achievement was uh, overhead press uh, one plate because I always struggled with like 25s on it. And I'm like, dude, this is sad. I was like, why can I not do 135? Yeah, but, yeah, you know, bro. Doing all that, I was like, oh, I finally did it. I from from repping this. from repping a plate on bench for like 10 to overhead pressing that bro you I, I don't even know if you realize but that's a huge accomplishment like let me tell you that takes some like, immense strength bro so um that was amazing seeing you be able to go from you know transferring that strength from just like one rep getting to a place where you can just get so much stronger in every aspect of your lifting journey man uh, i know we built tons of muscle in the process um man i know we put yeah, I know we, I know we were pushing you hard, man. And, and, and also I know, uh, food's expensive too. So, uh, that kind of ties into like, you know, what was the, what was one of the biggest obstacles? I know when we first were trying to get you on board, like there's a lot of things in your way, uh, mentally, physically, financially, like what was the biggest obstacle and you know, how did we, how did we make that happen for you? Absolutely. Yeah. So when we first talked about price points, uh, you know, you did give me the option of like whether paying it all up front, like all at once, or if you want, we could do uh, payment options. And then one of the services that you provide well, that you accepted was a uh, PayPal. And I love using PayPal because if you spend over a hundred dollars, uh, PayPal gives you the chance to pay within six months. Uh, so because of the, you know, the financial situation and food, uh, doing that monthly, I was able to stay on top of my payments without paying uh, any interest, without uh, worrying about like overdraft fees or anything, still buying uh, food to get my protein intake, but then, you know, you uh, taking advantage of PayPal. So then that way I don't pay interest. Absolutely, man. I know that was a big thing because and I remember when I pre presented the price here, you're like, oh, you're like, yikes. But I was like, bro, it's all good. We yeah. can work this out. Let's work together. Let's partner up. Let's team up. Uh, I know how bad you wanted it. I know how bad you wanted these results. I know how much it meant to you, man. So I was more than happy to find a way for us to work together. 
Um, thankfully, there's all sorts of options in terms of financing. There's options in terms of how we can break it into payments to make it work for you, man. So um, I'm so stoked that we were able to do that. And obviously, we were able to see some absolutely phenomenal results doing it. Um, and I appreciate you, you know, working like with me and, and I'm sure you work with like other clients to do it because, you know, these goals are attainable, but a lot of people are just scared because they don't know how to go about it. You know, maybe if more people knew about like the PayPal credit, you know, they'd use it. Absolutely, man. And, and I've already told you this before too, man. I was like, you know, as much as I love working with super high level individuals, one of my favorite things is working with people who obviously really value certain services that we provide. And I know personally, the people who have the hardest time financially, whether it's like trying to make the payments or trying to pay for this, they also tend to be the people who see the absolute best results. And that's simply because that value means so much more to them. Yep. And it's going to mean so much more to them when they see those results. And they know that what they're getting and what they're paying for is going to completely transform their lives. So uh, I think you are literally a prime example of that. And that's exactly why you were able to excel in achieving that overhead press, increasing your bench press, like astronomically and same for your deadlift, man. And it was like, so amazing. And uh, also, I want to give you a huge shout out for, you know, also documenting your journey, sharing all those videos you did, like that was amazing for me, man. It was it was so cool to see like, I haven't had I've never had a client do that. And that was like, every time I saw your post, man, it was like touching. So I, that was that meant the world to me. The last piece of feedback that I really liked that you did um, for me is that when I did hit my 315 PR goal, like uh, that one time, you know, you sent me a shirt and I was like, dude, this is huge. Like, you know, it's a small act, but it went like so far away. Like every time I wear that shirt to the gym, I uh, kid you not, this is how I walk. Yeah. <laughs> yes, <laughs> let's go. Yeah, I'm stoked that, that that meant something to you too, man. And now you can wear that shirt and represent yeah. and have that memory of like hitting that PR. And uh, honestly, man, I know you're going to be picking up even heavier weight in the future. You, you got you got four plates in, in the future, man. I know you do. Um, working, but let man. me tell you, bro, it, it was seriously was a pleasure working with you. And, um, you know, I, I look forward to just seeing you continue to grow. And like, I know you're still kicking ass in the gym. Uh, I, I love to see that you're moved on into your career and doing more stuff in your world, you know, with cars, uh, with photography, with your, your editing, like, dude, I see you growing in every way. So, uh, it's, it's, it's been, it's been fucking awesome, man. Um, you know, I, you know, walking away or leaving this journey, you know, what do you think are some of the things that have impacted you in a way that you're going to keep as a foundation in your life, your health, your fitness that you can continue to do for the rest of your life? Uh, well, that's a, that's a very good question. Definitely like, one of the biggest things that I'm taking away is um, calorie management because I love sweets. I love cheesecake, you know, milkshakes, you know, cookies and all that stuff. Love your sweets. Uh, yeah. You, you know, and then my hot Cheetos, my kettle flaming yeah. hot Cheetos. <laughs> Absolutely. So, uh, so my biggest takeaway has always been um, after working with you is eating as much protein as you can, you know, getting your protein intake. And then once you realize you fulfilled that, you know, you could fill it in, you know, with your cheesecake, with your chips and, you know, and enjoy in moderation and you don't have to like kill yourself. So for that, I am like truly grateful and blessed because every time I eat, I make sure, you know, protein first and I'm like, okay, cool. Got my goal kettle chips in my mouth enjoy yourself yes man and that's that and that's is. honestly like my biggest goal as a coach is i want to teach people that they can still have the foods they love they can still actually enjoy life while yes. also seeing results and all it really takes is that one thing you mentioned man which is once you get your protein then enjoy life but until then you have to get that in or we're not going to be able to move the needle forward so um that's exactly. literally my favorite thing to hear bro because that's exactly my mission and uh, it sounds like we did a great job, man. And uh, I just want to say, you've been officially taught not told, man. So uh, yeah, for... buddy! let's go. <laughs> bro. I'm glad I was able to do this. Thank you, bro. Have a great rest of your day, man. And uh, I'll see you soon. Cool. Take it easy. Peace.